Fall is often a great time to conduct a soil test because many of our recommended soil amendments actually take about six months to adjust the pH in the soil. So, follow these recommendations before you get going on your growing season next year. First, grab yourself a bucket and a mini shovel, and then we're gonna determine our sample area. So for example, I have here a typical lawn that I'm gonna to try to gather 10 various locations within this lawn to mix up in this bucket that will represent one sample. So here, we're gonna dive into our first sample location. And we're gonna dig about six inches deep into the soil. You can see that a lot of the grass was caught in this sample as well. So we're gonna remove that top of the grass, remove any rocks or debris that might be in there. And that's gonna be our first sample uh, representative there. And we're gonna do that nine more times and mix this up in the bucket. All right, now that we've collected at least 10 locations that will be our representative sample, I have here a soil box that can be picked up at a county extension office. Uh, and we're gonna get our bucket and transfer that soil into the sample box. Make sure we fill this up all the way so that the soil analysis lab has plenty of enough soil to analyze. We'll fold that up. We wanna make sure of two things here, uh, that our name is on this soil box and that we have the same sample name. So here I just made one up called Lawn and make sure that this matches our submission sheet, which here I have Lawn as well. And I have our two crop codes, L for Lawn, so I'll get soil recommendations for our, my particular lawn. And I've just included another crop code G for Garden in case I wanna uh, locate a garden uh, on this property as well. Now our sample is ready to go with the submission sheet and the submission box and we're gonna send this off to the Soil, Plant, and Pest Center. Be sure to reach out to your county extension agent on further instructions, or even actually going through the soil results with you and interpreting exactly which fertilizer recommendations or further soil amendments you might need for your specific crop, garden, or lawn. I hope this soil result demonstration works for you and your landscape, and best of luck next growing season.